morning, good afternoon, and good evening. It is I, your host, Brooding Gamer, here for another episode of Jurassic World Evolution 2 Monster Park. Last episode, we uh, made the Loch Ness Monster. We today are going to be working on our Frankenstein exhibit. And if you can't tell by the thumbnail, we are doing Indominus Rex. Because what animal or dinosaur better represents Frankenstein than the Frankenstein dinosaur itself? A dinosaur made up of other dinosaurs. I mean, not literally. It's not like uh, other dinosaurs were chopped up and used to make it. But it is indeed an animal made of the DNA of many other animals. And of course, you may be thinking, yeah, well, you know what? If you think about it, all the dinosaurs in the series and in the game and in the movies or whatever are all technically Frankenstein dinosaurs. But let's be honest, Indominus was the OG hybrid um, in real sense, you know, like actually announced to be made of other dinosaurs, not just other animal DNA. So, without further ado, as I clear out this path, we need to make quite the sizable exhibit for our Indominus Rex, or Frankenstein. Um, I have very carefully checked to see what skin would best represent the Indominus Rex in its Frankenstein-esque form. So we need to get this out here, clear this out, and then we will add trees here shortly. Uh, we'll probably be doing the tower viewing centers because that makes it look a little bit more like, you know, castle towers. I'm not entirely sure. The spires. Um, this is going to be a bit of an awkward build because I'm not sure how to go about doing this. Uh, let's see here. And I also realized I did not make this in this. Oh, no, wait a minute. Make this entire map flat when I came out here. Everything is... Uh, Everything has an, a, a slight hill, which is not bad, but we like to make our own. So let's uh, stop the chat and get to the speed build. Roll that spooky music.
And we are done with our Frankenstein themed exhibit. I am very happy with this, the way this turned out. I'm a little annoyed with the fact that, well, I mean, there's a lot of green over here and there's a lot of green over here, but I mean, it's bound and we're bound to, uh, you know, repeat some colors. So the Indominus Rex that we have here, let's go ahead and change the name to Frankenstein, even though, nope, not fur. We're not naming him fur. Um, we do know that, of course, Frankenstein was not the name of the monster. It was the name of the scientist. So the monster's actual name is Frankenstein's monster. Demogorgon, you need to stop screaming so dang much. Okay, so over here is the beginning. We really, 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 really need some archways front here. Anyway, let's go into front first person view here. This is off the beaten path. Over here, over there is our Loch Ness Research Center, if you can't tell. But uh, yeah, you come over here. And I wanted to implement, you know, Frankenstein takes place up in the mountains. Uh, the whole castle is in the mountains, which you'll see here in a minute. Um, so we've got a lot of rocks going around here and a lot of green lights to separate that. Frankenstein is indeed afraid of fire. Well, Frankenstein's monster is indeed afraid of fire. So we have a lot of fire out here to make sure that it stays in its enclosure. This is not the best. But there is our castle, the best way we could create it. Um, I'm not sure 100%. Oh, okay, this is just rotating, so you can see a 360-degree angle. You can even see our restaurant, Frankenburger's over there, just chilling out. Lots of fire, indeed. Uh, let's get back to the actual enclosure, though. Uh, you'll see that I've got the castle the best way I could, which is the raptor pen with a few of those big towers there. for Well, that tower there to implement, you know, that's where the lightning struck to bring the monster back to life. And all the torches for the, man, uh, for the castle leading down of course it's definitely not the scale but it is just there for theming so let's get out of this tower and we will go to we have I, I need to put something in there maybe some rocks or something just to decorate that little spherical circle there I did decorate some crates and everything because this and the cage where the monster was kept is what we have here this is what I at least themed it. I highly doubt the Indominus would even fit in here but I thought it looks cool. Let's put it here. Uh, definitely some theming in the area, but we definitely have... Ooh, I love the glowing on that crate. That looks really cool. But, you know, crates here full of weird science objects for the monster. Uh, well, or for the scientist. Okay, so to our right is Frankenburgers. Uh, green, eerie, and, uh, well, they sell burgers and fries. And then over here is our center viewing station. So we will go in here and see if we can. And there she is. He is. Whatever. Um, our Frankenstein monster there. We're using a couple of skins here. I honestly can't remember what I used, but uh, the name of them anyway. But it's like a green with like a black highlight on the top of the head there to uh, resemble the hair. Because, uh, you know, green skin, black hair. Uh, but I think that he or she looks gorgeous. Uh, we are, will, of course, go in there. I'm not going to take a look at that viewing tower because, well, you've seen how bad the view can be. Some more crates added in there for theming. But let's go into the exhibit and actually look at the monster itself. So there's the castle way up there. And he, where'd you go? Oh. Let's see if we can turn a light on. Oh, no. Uh, what, what? No. I forgot what button the light was supposed to be. It is this. So we're in the woods. Oh, I could make some really good movies with this. Oh, this is creepy. Oh, that was actually kind of eerie. I like that. All you heard was the stomping and everything. So let's get a better up close and personal look at our Frankenstein's monster. Beautiful green skin. Should have named you Shrek. Those eyes. And then that kind of darker tint to the top of the head there going its working its way down. 
I don't think we could have picked a better monster to represent Frankenstein, to be 100% honest with you guys. I think we did a really good job here. So, if you guys, I mean, have any other ideas of what we could be doing, just by all means, let me know. All right, let's get out of here. And that is our Frankenstein-themed area. Yes, of course, we do need to start making some bathrooms and other things, which I think I'll do off-camera because I actually haven't done that yet, and I'm sure my guests would absolutely love some restrooms, so we're actually, I'm not going to do it right here, or do it in this video, but I am going to create here an area for our, oh, actually, that, uh, let's see, replace, that's, that's what I was wanting to do. I actually like this this pathing over here for this particular section. We'll do pathing for certain areas. But, uh, yeah, I really need to get some bathrooms in here for my guests. So I'll plop a few bathrooms down. And uh, too bad it won't fit right there. Well, one would fit there. One would fit there unless I can get one to fit dead center here. But I can't because stupid. Um so yeah we're gonna we'll, we'll place a couple bathrooms down right here and then i will like theme this area up like crazy here in just a little while to see if we can can i can i do that can i bring that up to that no i actually i i can't <laughs> uh since i'll just bring that up there and stretch that out the best I can but oh that 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 went ugly actually really ugly uh, probably should have paid more attention to where I placed these sorry folk oh actually see they're about even they really are uh, so yeah let's go ahead and just um how do, how do I want to do this? <laughs> okay. Well, I said I wasn't going to do it on camera, and yet here I am doing it on camera. So, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and stop this video here. We are probably over our time limit anyway. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this um, throwback episode, I'm going to call it, because, you know, Frankenstein and all that. I don't know. Or, uh, I don't have any way of replacing food. And he is empty. That needs to be changed. I'm definitely doing that off camera. Um, if you guys enjoyed this episode, by all means, please leave a like. And if you're not yet subscribed, please subscribe for more videos. Because we're always trying to delve further into the Jurassic World or Jurassic Park rabbit hole on this channel. So thank you all for watching. I love you all. And I will see you all in the next video. This is Brooding Gamer. Thank you.